These niggas had this shit, but I'm talking about like, you bust a nigga, nigga bust. Man, you gotta shoot a nigga cause you can't beat him up. Nigga gonna kill you for beating him up. So you gotta go and blame this nigga. You gotta shoot him. He don't even shoot a nigga. Like I told you, nigga like me shoot nigga in the pinky toe. Nigga liable to die. Just cause my luck fucked up. Leave me alone, man. That's why I stay at home play my game, nigga. Cause I ain't that type of nigga who gonna let a nigga sit there and play with him. So I'm gonna go ahead, you know, you know you got the movies, the movies come on from the beginning to the end. My movie ain't gonna last long, bro. It's just gonna be, you know, come on, you playing ball. Your ass out of here, man. You ain't no motherfucking ending. The ending coming fast. Hold on, even come. I ain't gonna make no money off my movies, nigga, because nigga ain't, ain't no. Nah, nigga. Nah, nah. I like Charles White. Nah, 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 nah. Nah, nigga. Man, these, bro, you, you, I'm telling you. I stay in the house, wanna shoot a nigga, play Call of Duty or some shit, bro. I get out the way. But if you play with me, I'm gonna stamp you like a post and like, that shit, like, motherfucker, the internet don't know how gangsta I am. If I don't portray that image, you need to play with me. I promise you, nigga. See, that's like taking a walk from 62nd to 63rd, nigga, whatever you call it. All right, play with me. Yeah, they'll try you. Yeah, they'll try you because niggas don't know no better. That's why you gotta go on the bus. It's crazy. That's why niggas get shot. Because you can't go there and beat up little, little, little Ray Ray. Go there and jump on little Ray Ray them. Ray Ray them gonna bust your ass, bro. Tomorrow. He ain't gonna, might be the same night. Think you finna go home, somebody gonna send 75 holes through your goddamn house. You better go on outside and fade them, boy. <laughs> this shit real, boy. Real nigga can't win right now, bro. You gotta be all the way out of the way, bro. Like, hey. Like, there's a lot of niggas get away with shooting people. Let me go out here and bother niggas. Man, them motherfuckers gonna be lined up in front of my house in that morning. Come on out there, here. Come on out here, man. You ain't your stupid out here, bro. Come on. Come on out here, man. Like, let me talk to you, sir. Man, nigga, get away on the camera. Let me do one thing. Nigga, shit, my luck done. I've been doing good for too long, nigga. Like, nigga, I ain't been no trouble since I've been in my 20s, nigga. And I ain't been in no big trouble. I thank God for that. And I done did all the grimy and shit. I done did all this shit, bro. You got to come for nothing. Man, you got a simple possession. No so good with this shit, bro. Come on, man. No dope charge. Yeah, come on, bro. But I, right now, I feel like I fuck up. It's over. We owe you, nigga. Come on. Yeah, you think you be getting away, nigga. We, come on. Shot me the pick and get 30 years. Shot 30 years? My shot, nigga. 30. Think about that. New generation. Leave me the fuck alone, bro. I ain't here to play. They, they oh, call me, keep calling me unk and all that. Oh, he unk. Oh, he. I got them same guns y'all got. I'm a gun fanatic, nigga. I'll blow you. Play with me, nigga. You better find somebody to play with. Man, uh, Uncle already got there and want to go home now. Uncle already, got already got watching you too. Okay, little nigga. Man, I'm going to blow your nose. Then put that fan on you. The real fan. <laughs> nigga, this shit crazy. Real nigga. What? Boy, I'm telling you. Stay in the house, nigga. No niggas not going to let you win, boy. Hey, hey, nigga, nigga done shot you 75 times. You ain't told a goddamn thing. <laughs> And you hit a nigga, boy, you hit a nigga, man, nigga, shit. Oh, nigga, all right. Hey, man, we, hey, I don't care, you gotta talk about it. Like, you know, like, shit? Yeah, man, I don't need no, boy. That's why I don't even want to be cool with nobody, you know, you know who the snitch is no more, boy. Nigga got there. Nigga tell on anything now, boy. Nigga tell on you got a traffic ticket, boy. He ain't go to city court. I don't know what he, you know, I don't know how he got no license. <laughs> nigga, tell, <laughs> nigga tell everything, you know, boy. You got what? Anything, everybody, boy. Wait, wait, you cannot win out this motherfucker hey. no more. If you out here trying to win out here, boy, you is a damn loser. Get back in the house. You ain't got nothing to prove no more. All the morals and codes are broken right now, nigga. Hey. So if you not a street nigga, bro, it's not the time to get in this shit. Hey, bro. What do you think? When the big brother was knocking the shit out of him, we were looking around there, telling the damn mom every goddamn thing. He keep hitting me, mom. He keep hitting me, mom. 
Mama tell you hit him back, but nah, nah, nah. You keep running back in there and goddamn tell him shit. That's how snitching first started. So they was look. It started at an early age. Yeah, shit started early, boy. We telling telling everything. See, when you a kid, you allowed to do that, but when you get to a certain age, you know, shut the fuck up with your bug bug back in your goddamn mouth. You know what I'm saying? Lick for a lick, nigga. You hit me. I ain't gonna tell him I'm gonna bust your ass back. Pow! Beat your ass, nigga. Shut up. Yeah, boy. Nigga gun, that bitch kind. You gonna tell on you about you, you got it. You, you fuck a nigga bitch. See, nigga gonna get grind on you about fucking that bitch. Nigga gonna tell everything. But nigga get grind on trying to fuck your bitch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, tell you a nigga do. You tell a nigga do your bitch, man. All right. You said nigga know nigga know your bitch, right? You fuck around and goddamn hit a nigga bitch with him. Nigga goddamn come at your bitch like, hey, you know, boy, we not be together no more, ain't? Eh? So your bitch gonna be like. Why? Or like, what you talking about? The little lame man, they probably come in like, nah, I mean, I seen that nigga got there chilling with such stuff, man. You know what I'm saying? Even though old that's a nigga do. He done told you sauce, man. Now you stuck in the middle. You don't know what. You'll be here. You about this hoe. And you know your whole thing. You know this hoe ain't saying name. You don't know where this shit coming from. You don't even look thinking the nigga. Whole time, you think you think you little cheat and told on you. It ain't even her. It's the nigga. Like, damn, bro. Yeah, bro, I told on you, bro. It ain't no winning out here, bro. You can't get no money no more. The best thing you do to get some money is don't show it. Don't show the money. You got a nigga the popping up. Man, yeah, nigga, you either gonna get licked, beat, killed, police get you. Your family member gonna bury you because as soon as they see the money, they, yeah, yeah, bro, no, but I got them. Everybody was throwing with them, let me hold or something. I done yeah. been through this shit. That's why I don't post no money. Put me hold. No. You can't say no. You just post the $75,000 million. Dollars. Say no, you want to. Man, oh, pussy ass nigga. Now nah, everybody gonna get your pussy ass nigga. Yeah. Just because you posted your money. That might be my money I posted from three years ago. I got a lot of these motherfuckers like I ain't got it. They whole time they think it don't stink. They lying. But they think you can say they lying now. Hey, um, I just seen a car down here, goddamn. He won't but goddamn 4500 for it. Me, um. Shit, no, you better goddamn work hard, baby boy. I'm just keeping it real. Shit, this nigga gonna ban me for that, boy. Man, this shit ain't gonna be right to go with Auntie Hotter no more, boy. Man. Nah, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. I like Charles the White say, nah, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. This nigga gonna ban the hell out of my black ass, bro. Oh, can't keep it real no more. Bro, hard, oh, boy. Yeah, nigga, see everything free now. Ah, oh, nigga. You put them six hours in a week. You better go goddamn on that clock, boy. Let's sell them bags or something. But one thing I do like about the new generation, though, you nigga got some money. Yeah, I ain't gonna cap. We was some money getting niggas, too, but I had some big money when I was younger, but these niggas, see, most niggas hate on the young generation. Like, no. These niggas get trapped. But what I'm saying is, what I try to break to them is like, invest, bro. Like, it been thousands of times I had big money, but I ain't put it into them. You know what I'm saying? You got to put that shit into something, that shit come back out. Now when that money go, you still got this investment still pumping out. This investment still going. This shit might be, this shit might be general wealth. Like, this shit might last forever, bro. Like, you never know. Invest that shit, bro. Instead of spending shit on shit you want, invest. This shit lasts forever, man. Think about the next generation coming up. Just think about if you don't got kids, you might have kids one day. Invest that shit. Like I see a couple niggas doing them dogs. Them niggas there, they, they doing some smart investment because these boys are buying high, expensive dogs. These niggas not buying the bullshit dogs no more. Niggas are buying the real fucking dogs, so they getting the real money now. Niggas getting the 10s and the 20s and the 30s and 40s and 50s and 1000s, $100,000 for a dog. So... I respect some of y'all niggas on that. And you got some young niggas out here flipping houses, doing all kind of shit, bro. You know, niggas just working. You got other niggas out here and females, you know, that make up their own businesses and that are making real money, too. You know what I'm saying? It, we can do, like I tell niggas, we can do whatever. Like, bro, we can do whatever we want to do, bro. I'm going to tell you, all it takes 
all it takes to doing whatever you want to do is you got to have everybody on the same team. If you got everybody in the same boat, bro, the ship going the ship gonna make it through the storm, through the, through the water. See, when everybody on the same ship, like, if everybody on the same team, like, everybody, even though you're on the same ship, everybody on the same ship, because everybody want to be the captain. So when everybody want to be the captain, that means everybody got their own ways of thinking, saying, yeah, I'm going to do this shit. Fuck them niggas talking about. You know what I'm saying? You know, niggas just agreeing to do their own shit, and everybody's shit ain't the same. So shit breaks in part. You have niggas beefing with each other for no reason. Niggas don't get shit time to come together before they start falling out. Niggas like to fall out when the first little bit of the money fuck up. No, bro, this shit going to hammer along the way. You know what I mean? Niggas in business now, they, and they lost out millions and millions, and now they up millions, and now they probably up billions. They gonna take a loss, bro. Nigga be ready to give up in the first quarter. Like, nigga, why the fuck you came to the game, bro? Nigga J got fouled. He wanna give up. Man, get the fuck out of the team, bro. Leave your bitch ass over here. You ain't gave up on the game because you, come on, man. Life is like a game of basketball, too, bro. You know, <laughs> you got your fouls. You got your technical fouls. You know, you got your three-pointers. You got your two-pointers, too. You know what I'm saying? That shit big in life. Some niggas hit threes all their life. They do it big. You know what I'm saying? Some niggas live by the tools, nigga. They making it. They ain't still doing it big. You know, you got some nigga go to free throw up a three-pointer and hit but one shot. You got a one. Niggas still making it. Bro, it's all about how you put yourself in it. It's all about how you put yourself in bounds without going out of bounds. Niggas don't get it, bro. But I'm going to tell you, though, when everybody sit back and say, like, white folks are the richest motherfucker, yeah. They're some of the richest motherfuckers because they stick together. But we wasn't stick together. Everybody be rich. Everybody be rich. Everybody be. Man, come on, bro. Who you think keep Gucci and all them motherfuckers? Gucci, Prada, Louis. Who yeah, you think keep them shit afloat? Man, that's us. That's our culture, bro. Oh, man. Nigga, get a check for goddamn $4,500. to $500. He ready to go to Gucci and spend $3,500. Keep $1,000 in the pocket. It, it's brainwashing out here. Nigga just want to go stunt. I go do that shit when that bitch seven days. You gonna see me another seal that motherfucker on bitch. Don't take no picture of me. You fuck gonna have a goddamn a whole whole week full of pictures, different days. This nigga been everywhere. Yeah, yeah. No, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. Charles the White on your ass, nigga. <laughs> we'll call this shit Charles and White flow, man. Without the police shit, cause I ain't got no. I fuck with Charles White on some shit he be saying. But the only thing I don't fuck with Charles White on is the police shit, cause that, that'll be never be a part of me. So that's why I stick, I still stick to codes and morals, and you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying, bro? If shit come to me, if I gotta do my time, bro, I gotta do my time, bro. Like, like, bro, I'm gonna tell you what my my favorite holiday lately before I go to sleep. I like watching Fun 480, bro. And watching how these niggas fold, nigga, need to take the out room like they Michael Jordan and and and, and Scotty Pippen and Steve and and. and you know what that boy named shooting three? Goddamn. Yeah, Curry. Steph Curry, like, hey, you now the boy shooting three pointers and they go back to their teammate and give them that. Yeah. yeah, nigga. Them nigga leave out them tailgates room, go in there, give each other that. Like, damn, yeah, like, nigga, these niggas know you finna go cross that road and come back cross that road, boy. And you over there tomorrow, so my bad, bro. Nigga, goddamn, first thing nigga fuck up and say, bro, I thought nigga trying to kill me. Oh, you son of a bitch. All right, you just place yourself on the scene. Motherfucker ain't even, hey, motherfucker ain't even see you. Like, one dude, the night I watched this shit, this motherfucker placed himself on the scene. The police were trying to ask the nigga what they do with the store where they had shot somebody down the street. Whole time, homeboy and shot somebody down the street. So he told you, yeah, I got a store in the house. So they got the tape for the store. He don't even know. I said, nah, bro. Ain't nobody got that car. Bro, I say, bro, really? You ain't even on the tape. He said, bro, you ain't even on the tape. Basically, the police were telling this nigga, like, bro, you just placed yourself in the car. I don't think I do say he ain't no man, bro. But one of them little niggas, though, two of them little niggas played it. Played it thorough, though, man. Both of them little niggas, the nigga who really killed him, though, he tried to throw the shit off on one of the boys, but he told him quick. He turned it back and, like, man, talk my lord. The other nigga that, that was in there. That nigga turned it back, man. That nigga, that was a thoroughbred, boy. That nigga, man, I ain't doing no. He like, who said, what the hell we talking for? But like, I ain't even tell y'all, nigga. I was like, that nigga was real, real. Y'all, nigga, get me. Talk to my lawyer. He turned it back. Like, oh, man, turn around. He said, I ain't got to turn around, man. Talk to my lawyer. Once you say talk to my lawyer, the nigga get up, bro. 
They walk on out. They pack their little things up, walk on out. See, when you tell them something, they got it on tape. And what they charge you with, you put yourself on the scene. Basically, they did the judge job already without going to trial, really, bro, because you done told yourself now. You basically got to plead your gifts because you done told you, done told you were there. I'm going there more. They're going to tell you niggas to, to done said they did this and did that. They don't know nothing, bro. That's why they asking you a dumb ass. Stupid. You're going to feel pressure when you go in there just... No, no, no. That's it. Talk to my lawyer. You ain't gotta have a lawyer, money, bitch. You tell him that. You, but just, just know you gotta go over and sit though. That nigga doesn't don't know that. Yeah, but you got, but you gotta go over and sit though. Maybe. That's it. But the niggas that don't know that, then you are not a school. Oh, you guys see me come here? Where you was? Hey man, get my lawyer, bro. All right. Nigga, pack their bags up and go back. Oh, he, he done lowered up. That's all they say. Fair for he done lowered up. Them boy be out there real so fast, them boy folks say that lawyer. Shit, bro, I need, I need a lawyer. All right, I'll let you. Do it night and say he gives in half for a lawyer. Dude said, what the fuck you need a lawyer for? <laughs> Police are crazy. He said, what you need a lawyer for? You need him now? You just told us what we need him. Stupid. And you going across the road. You told me you said, and you want to spend money. <laughs>